Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to our quick tutorial series that we are doing here on Epic Games. I know that some of uh, this tutorial is probably going to be a little silly. I think a lot of people are going to be like, why in the hell would you doing any AI tutorial? Well, surprisingly enough, I still get this question a lot on my channel. So if this is, if you already know everything there is to know on any AI, you don't have to watch. This is not for you, but it's definitely for the people who never or are just starting to use NEI and still wondering, you know, what can I do with it? So NEI is not enough items. Not enough items is this right here. You see all that awesomeness right there? That's what NEI items are. So I'm going to give you a brief basic tutorial on how to use it to craft the items, okay? Because uh, a lot of people don't know how to do it, and this is the best way. A lot of people think you got to go on the internet, try to search the recipes and stuff. Well, with NEI, you don't have to do any of that anymore. Okay, so in any eye, we have a few options. We got the option command here. In options here, you have the mod, the modes. You have cheat mode, recipe mode, and utility mode. Now let me tell you what the, each one does. Cheat mode allows you to actually give yourself items without being uncreative. So I can just click on it. Bam, I gave myself 64 of grass blocks right there. All right, so that's what that's for. So you can actually do cheat mode, and you can do change the time. So let's make it nighttime. There it is, see? And now remember, this only works on your local machine or your own personal server where you are an opt in the server. So there we go, so you can make it daylight. You can have, make it rain. Let's see if it gets some rain. There you go, it's raining. I have particles off because it's too freaking loud. You can make it not rain. You can actually make it to never rain if you shift click this thing right there. Also, you have the option to delete items too. So, for example, if I hit this thing right here, I can click any item in the inventory and it'll disappear. That's a trash can right there. Or you can grab it and drag it right into it and just click on it. Bam, item is gone. Also, let's see. Uh, let, me, let me find. Let me go into create it real quick. Let me find a, a place that I can uh, fly to. And, okay, there we go. All right, and let me take myself a create it. Take my hearts away and there you go. Ah! I'm hurt. I'm almost dead. Well, in any eye, you can also give you healing. Bam. You're healed. Done. You are a god in Minecraft. But anyway, but that is cheat mode. That's, that's, this is great and fantastic if you are somebody who creates maps and things like that. And you need uh, easy access to all your materials to get it done. You know, change the daylight and time and all of that stuff. This is great for you. If you are doing regular survival, get the hell off this thing. Because you're just ruining the game for yourself. <laughs> you never learned anything. <laughs> so anyways, but that's what it is. Okay, the other mode that we have, it is recipe mode. Recipe mode doesn't give you any options right there. As you can see, there's, there's really no options here to do anything, any of the cheat stuff. You know, it's all gone. No daylight, nighttime, healing, or anything like that. Even to delete items. But we have this. Still. You wanna know what the hell is the point of this now? Ah, that's the beautiful thing about it. With this one now, we can actually go and look for a recipe. You can either scroll down on the side here, click the next and previous button, however you want to do it. And then you can do it to, you can actually click on this bar right here in the bottom. You can do a search. So let's search for a pickaxe. Okay. It gives me every type of pickers that I can possibly do. Now, some items, because they're not available, such as Tinker's Construct, you can't get recipes from them because... Think it constructs, delivers you, and gives you a book on how to do this stuff. So you don't need it. But any other thing that has a crafting recipe, such as the diamond pickaxe, if you click it, look at that. It teaches how you can make a pickaxe with diamonds. And it also tells you the different type of materials that you can use. So for example, because I have diamonds of plenty, I'm able to use bamboo, and I'm able to use uh, some other, what's it called, reeds in here as sticks. Because Binance of Planet gives me that option. So whatever mods you got installed, any I will figure out, okay, well, this is just, just a regular stick, so you can actually use it to make a pickaxe. Sounds great, doesn't it? Awesome. So that's what it is. So search anything, anything you want, and you'll be able, it'll teach you how to actually make the recipes. All right, one more thing that is great about this um, is that, let's say, uh, let me go back to sheet mode real quick, and I'm going to give myself the diamonds that we need. Oh shoot. Oh crap. 
I'm trying to do a tutorial, dang it, leave me alone. Okay, anyway, so, so here we go, so I'm giving myself the diamonds, and I'm gonna give myself some sticks, and let's say, okay, so now let's go back to uh, recipe mode, in the options, oops, there you go. So let's say I'm here, I'm going to my crafting table, and I, hey, I wanna make a pickaxe. You can actually go and let's do the search for the pickaxe, right there, and say, sweet! Now, two things can happen here. You can either just click this question mark, and you can see little ghost figures on how you can actually put each item in order to make your pickaxe. It's great. Or, if you have the materials anywhere in inventory, you can click on it and do sh hold your shift button, and then click on the question mark, and it takes the items from your inventory, puts it out there, so you can actually just grab your pickaxe right there. So that's one way to actually do it. All right, so that's one of the great things that we have here on any eye to actually get uh, get things rolling and help you craft without you having to do step by step the recipe if you feel like doing you know such a thing. So there you go. So that's one of, that's one of the neat things about recipe mode. This is mostly the mode that you want to be in because watch this. I grab this item, I throw it here, it drops. I throw it there, it drops. I throw it up there, it drops. Throw it anywhere, it drops. Here's the problem with a little mode called utility mode. Utility mode gives you this problem. Utility mode works just like recipe mode. The difference is, is it gives you the trash can and the magnet. And it gives you one more option. You can still click and get the recipes and do the same thing that you do. But it also has another, another crazy thing. Is that a lot of people were so used to throwing items all over the place. If you're throwing item here, oh, it didn't do it that time. There we go. No, it didn't do it. What the hell? Making me a liar, any I. Anyways, mine doesn't do it. Mine is broken. <laughs> Anyways, on FTV, I can guarantee you this will happen. If you grab this and you throw it on the right side, it will get deleted. Just trust me, it'll get deleted. This is my uh, own uh, pack. That's why I'm. It's not really doing what I wanted to do. Let me go here, cheat one again, and make this into set to dawn. Okay, so anyway, so that's one of the things you got to remember with utility mode. So it works either way. I think I have it set up to not to do that because I don't want to make that mistake. But that's all config stuff that I'm not going to go into. But in FTB, remember, you throw items to the right, they will get deleted. Just, just remember that. Throw them on the left for be safe, okay? All right, now let's talk about the magnet mode. So let's say I'm going to grab this thing and I'm going to go like this. I'm going to throw a bunch of diamonds all the way in a row, okay? There you go. So sweet. Look at that. Look at all that mess. I gotta go and pick everything up like that. No, not really. I can just come here, click on the magnet mode, and bam. That's what that's for. So it's a very handy tool that you can use. Um, a lot of people feel that that's a cheat. <laughs> it's, it's your call what you decide that it's a cheat or not. Uh, it's something that you can use. Or if I use it only when I don't have any other options. The uh, power suit does have the option to do something like that and add on that you can add to the power suit to do this. So, or in FTB, there is a ring, some ring that can actually do it. Can't remember the name of the ring. But that's one of the basic things on NEI for that. Okay, sweet. Next, what we have on options here too is the ability to have what is called tooltips. Tooltips is the ability for you to be able to point something and in the screen is going to actually display what that is. So, I have it off, let's turn it on, normally it'll be off by default, turn it on and watch the middle of the screen, you see that, it's the sand, that's dirt, that's a flower, <laughs> doesn't tell me about the traveler, dirt, dirt, that's a pumpkin, see, there you go, it's grass, so there you go, so that's, it's a great tool, but, if you use the twilight forest, do not, Use this in the Twilight Forest is glitched for some reason. You start uh, making things look freaking weird, so just don't use it on there. But in regular overworld, it works just fine. Okay, so next, what we have over here. Uh, so once we have that, that is that is all there is to this. All right. So then this other stuff, um, this sort of stuff, and more advanced stuff. I am not gonna get into this. This is uh, more for people who are doing custom mod packs and things. Are trying to put mods together and things like that. This is something I'm not going to get into today, but uh, you can look into this. Uh, I'll look into this some other time. Okay, uh, try to control. 
basic stuff, just how to change the settings on any eye, on anything that you want to do. Uh, other than that, that is pretty much it for any eye. Now, if at any point this happens to you, you are here and you hit this and it's like, what the freak? My any eye is gone. Yo, what happened? Don't panic. Just hit the letter O and you have it back. That's it. That's all there is to it. Hit the letter O and you are good to go. So there you go, guys. That is one of the basic any eye tutorials that I can give you. Um, oh, wait, one last thing. Item subset. This is a good one, too. If you ever want to see items by mods, you can go over here. And you can see what each mod has for items. See, you can do there, primitive mobs, where you can get the portal guns. It'll show you exactly what it is. It's something that you can use over here to see by individual mods, maker, you know. So that's it. That's all I got for you guys. I hope this helps somebody out there. I know some people think it's going to be a little silly. And there's probably is a thousand tutorials out there. But nonetheless, it's just a high demand on my live stream and some of the people that I know here. So I'm just going to make one happen and call it a day. So there you go, guys. I hope you enjoy. If you enjoyed it, please like the video. Share it with your friends, whoever needs it. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Later, Epic Nation. Thank <laughs> you.